Ladies and gentlemen, it is that time again. It is time for another episode of the WWE 2K24 My Rise Undisputed Chris Damage Story. That is a mouthful. I'm your host, Chris Best. Let's get right into it. Yes, I did leave Chris Damage standing here for an entire week. No, I'm kidding. Uh, let's continue the story. Uh, when last we left off, the bloodline had reunited with Brock Lesnar uh, as they're the Beast Incarnate. Um me tweeting right now on social media, it's time for the bloodlines to start looking over their shoulders for a change. And the WWE doing the uh, the eyes uh, emoji. All right, let's get right into this thing, man. This is a... Uh, 1,253 days as Roman's... Uh, reign as champion in this game i don't think that was his actual number The bloodline reunited and stronger than ever. You can see the confidence that uh, Solo had. Oh, look at that. There I am attacking Solo. Oh, backstage brawl with uh, Solo, huh? All right, Solo. It's time for you to go down. I am, uh, what am I going to need to do here? Irish whip. Solo, solo, solo. Come on. Can I climb up here? Get your ass up here, Solo. Follow me. I want to try something here. Oh, geez, catching me with that spin wheel kick. Oh, bro, uh, solo, solo. You're, 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 you're not supposed to be doing this kind of stuff, you know? Oh, okay, so now what? Fight solo over to the red car. Okay, so we're actually going to get down from here. I was going to try and throw solo. Cause I want to see if I can throw solo off into that light there. Um, well, solo is uh, being lazy and wants to take the elevator. We got to look for a red car, though. Hey, a weapon. Nope. Solo, I don't know what you think you're, who you, who do you, I don't know who you think you are, but uh, you're not going to take, oh, you, maybe you are going to take me down. Shh. Wasn't paying attention. That's my fault.
red car so okay right here right here right here right here And just continue. Oh, Jay and Jimmy and Jay coming in. And I'm down with the Samoan spike. Oh, throwing me right into the side of that car. Uh oh, I'm I'm definitely going for a shield bomb. <clears throat> My championship match against Brock Lesnar could very well be in jeopardy. After sustaining injuries due to the Bloodline's brutal parking lot, a parking lot attack, Chris Damage has been released from a local medical facility. Typical WWE language. Roman Reigns uh, coming in and saying, love what my family did to the Dark Horse. How'd you like that trip to the glue factory? Oh, Chris Damage. Oh, and you're going to get yours. I promise you on that one. All right, Sammy. We got... That didn't turn out so well. Uh, yeah, maybe you were right. There is no taking the bloodline out one at a time. There's only taking them all out in a single blow with even numbers. The Usos have a match tonight. I should strike afterwards when they least expect it. Or should I say we? You win? Yep. But knowing how they operate, we're going to need one more guy. You got someone in mind? I think I do. I do. Oh, geez. Again, these are my guys that were my partners for fucking, for part of my language there. War games. Oh, I got to go with Finn. Let's I'm going to pick Finn. Finn has been pretty loyal to me. And then there's me on the social saying, hey, Ed, Roman Reigns, how's the weather out in L.A.? Stoked for our for your cousin's match tonight. Definitely check it out. Going to be a barn burner. And uh, the Usos take a win in their tag team match. Didn't even tell us who they were facing. But uh, Sami Zayn and, uh, yeah, there we go. Myself and Sami Zayn taking down the Usos, just pummeling them uh, right now. No sign of Solo, though. And i am got, got to assume that uh, Solo's going to make his presence felt. Okay. So now we're beating up the Usos. I've got Jimmy. He's got Jay. Yeah. 
the lower right corner. So that would be the corner that we just got away from right here. Strike them. All right, we're back to the story just once again. And look, there, here comes Solo. Now we've got, oh, here, there we go. There's my boy. And now the three of us pummeling the three of them, evening these odds. But we still have Brock Lesnar hovering around somewhere. And we still got Roman Reigns. Let's not forget about that. The balance of power just shifted on the road to WrestleMania. Roman Reigns coming in and saying, Chris Damage must think he's pretty smart. Sami Zayn and the only other ally the Dark Horse could find are going to regret it for the rest of their lives. And all that's going to be left at Mania are bones for the beast to pick. Don't let me down, Usos. So, and that's Solo. And probably Brock Lesnar. You must be feeling pretty good about yourself after outsmarting the bloodline. Well, you get to keep riding that high because I have some good news for you. What do you want, Pip Squeak? That would be a first. Miz has made a match. You and your two self-destructive brothers in arms are going to take on the bloodline in a no disqualification six man oh. tag match. Yeah, give me that match. I'll pummel the, oh, the crap out of them. To get that out without looking at the note on your hand. Good job, Troy. We accept. Oh, one thousand percent. We accept this match. Let's go. Regal coming in and, uh, in my DMs and saying, "I admire your fortitude in taking this fight to the bloodline." But you are so close to matching Reigns' record and stepping out of his shadow once and for all. Walking into WrestleMania injured or not, walking in or not walking in at all, would we'll throw it all away. Me uh, with my response saying, I appreciate you, but I know what I'm doing. You focus on getting healthy. I want you at Mania to see me make history. Yeah. Let's just say I'm going to beat the living snot out of these, uh, the bloodlines here. <clears throat> All right, let's go. Right here on an episode of SmackDown. Six man tag team action, the bloodline. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to get to the six-man tag and beat some people up. Let's do it.
And here we come, myself, <laughs> Team Dark Horse, myself, Finn Balor, and uh, Sami Zayn teaming up here. All right. Who, who gets me? I can't even tell who's kicking me. Am I fighting Finn? Okay, I didn't. Sorry, Finn. I didn't mean to fight you. My bad. Oh, geez. Jimmy, would you please let me up? No disqualification, right? Solo. Solo, what do you think you're doing? You're not allowed. Not allowed. Get off the ropes, please. Oh, jeez, come on. Just gonna beat up uh, Jay Uso out here. Trying to look. Oh, there I am. Okay, I couldn't find myself on the bottom uh, um, screen there. Oh, I didn't think he was going for a suicide dive. Jimmy or Jay, what are you doing? Oh, no, you don't. I just take Jimmy's uh, head off. Uh, Jesus, Jimmy, 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 what are you doing? see if I can just get them off the roll up here because uh seem to have the advantage here they got uh, the bloodline on the outside I'm talking about Sammy and uh, uh, Finn there I'm kind of hoping that they keep them on the outside why did you have to throw Jay in as I said that Sammy why So I'm about to finish off Jimmy here. Son of a... Well, we'll take, oh, I thought we were going to take the win there.
Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy, Sammy, you need to get in and give us a hand here. I know you're down and out, but like, come on. Really focused on getting this match over and done with here. I don't even... Let's see if we can get a win off this, please. Where is Solo's uh, health? Oh, there it is. Oh, I thought I had him. I thought I had Solo. Finn, I need your help. Come on, get up. Or throw a weapon at me and then knock me down even more. And there we go. We took the win. I let Finn get that pin on that one. <laughs> I saw what he was doing, so I, I'm like, okay, I'm going to back up and watch for what Jimmy and Jay are doing. But right now, we uh, we just taken out uh, Jimmy, Jay, and Solo. And just as it says right there on the screen, Romo, Roman cannot be happy. Look how bloody Sammy is. Oh, look, there's the beast incarnate himself, Brock Lesnar. Attacking my alliances, of course. Wait a minute. What, what's he planning to do with that chair? Oh, of course. He's going to get me in the F5.
All right, let's continue this. All right, let's go. Okay, so now we're back here. We're in the locker room. Uh, Roman Reigns coming in on his social media saying, my family let me down again, but I don't need them. I can't wait to kick back in my trailer on the set of my new movie and watch the beast Brock Lesnar devour what's left of the whore of that horse meat. I warned you, Chris Damage, now the receipt is on its way. And uh, also, WWE, we're already at WrestleMania. Wow. Okay, night one, uh, WWE saying night one of WrestleMania is upon us. 24 hours before Chris Damage would tie Roman Reigns' record-setting WWE Universal Championship run. The Dark Horse defends his title. Oh, I'm defending on night one. Okay, I get it. I get what's going on here. All right, so Brock Lesnar and I, night one of WrestleMania. Kind of a... It's kind of a night two kind of thing, don't you think? All right, Miz, we've had our troubles in the past, but what do you want right now? The walking wounded have arrived. I'm honestly surprised you made it after what Brock did to you and your friends last week. Plus years, Miz. I think you would have learned about doubting me by now. Tonight, those doubts finally come true. I tried to warn you years ago that this would end in tears. That you would come this close in getting out of Roman's shadow and failed at the finish line is going to eat you up for the rest of your life. You know the definition of insanity, right? Repeating the same action again and again, expecting different results. Well, there, uh, there's a there's a shout out at Far Cry Three right there. So what? So that's you underestimating me and having it blow up in your face every time. Not this time. Not against Brock Lesnar. Are you really just did you really just try to imitate Paul Heyman there is okay I'm gonna paint you a picture I keep my titles tonight tying Roman's universal record then tomorrow I watch night two of mania with my feet up in a skybox as the clock strikes midnight and I beat Roman's record no yes Miz Yes. And then on SmackDown, you are going to have the honor of introducing me as the longest reigning universal champion in WWE history. I guarantee you that will not happen. That will not happen. <laughs> it's match time. It's match time, boys. It's time to go to WrestleMania. Regal saying my surgeons are across from me. Uh, surgeons, what am I? Surgeons, what happened? Doctors in Britain. Doctors. In Britain, we call doctors surgeons. Another time. The point is, I've ignored their advice, and I'm coming to WrestleMania. I want to see you face Brock in person. I can't say I support this decision, but I appreciate the vote of confidence. I have faith in you, champ.
I'm not sure what the theme of this WrestleMania set is, but okay. But uh, old Broccoli Lesnar making his way to the ring here to uh, lose because I'm going to beat him. That's just how it's going to be, Brock. And there I am, all confident with my two championships. Let's just get right to the match here. Both titles are on the line. Let's get right to the action. All right. Hit Brock with two combos. Right, so got him with two combos. Take Brock to the floor. And attack him there. Okay, I don't... I'm really focused on this match right now for some reason. Even though I'm fully, full-on confident that I'm going to beat Brock Lesnar here. Okay, attack Brock on the floor. What's the next task? Taunt Brock. So I'm going to throw Brock in the ring and taunt him like this. Now I've just got to defeat Brock by pinfall or submission. So I just got to beat him up and have a match with him. Just a, a lot of pent-up anger and Chris damage right now as he is just doing everything he can to make sure Brock does not get back to his feet. Say that, and of course he gets to his feet, but I take him right back down. Uh, I'm going to hit that choke slam on him. Going to hit the uh, finisher on him. I don't think this is going to finish Brock, but we'll see. If it does, I'm going to be sh completely shocked. One, two, <laughs> three. There we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Defeated Brock Lesnar in like, I don't know, five minutes. But there, oh, wait a minute. Oh, Roman Reigns on the screen. You know what, Roman? I don't want to hear it. You've been doing this for three years now. Instead of, what is it you're doing? Celebrity guest host on some game show, chilling your new NFT, or maybe 
just maybe you're filming another cameo in a failing sequel. Don't know what to say without a script? I'll help you out. The only table you're the head of anymore is the one that Rock brushes his crumbs onto. I'm here. I'm doing the work. And the only thing... I'm sure you got a lot to say, but it doesn't matter. When you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. Wow, Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns making his return to the WWE and taking me down here. He wants his belt back. His belt that he voluntarily gave up, by the way. Hope you're not too busy tomorrow night, Jim. Because the landlord is back. And rent is due. Well, the announcer's not really putting a lot of faith in me with those uh, comments that appeared on your screen. But it looks like night two, I am defending my championship against Roman Reigns. Kayla, night one of WrestleMania was an incredible experience, but all of the focus now is on what happened after the undisputed champion defeated Brock Lesnar. That's right, Byron. Roman Reigns made a shocking return by laying out the champion right after his successful main event defense. The dark horse slayed the beast, but immediately fell to the head of the table. Roman Reigns then issued a challenge for tonight. And the undisputed champ accepted. For the first time in WrestleMania history, one superstar will be main eventing both nights. In addition to Charlotte Flair's huge Women's World Championship defense against Gigi Dolan, the WWE Universal title will be on the line. The undisputed champ will defend against Roman Reigns, who stated that his only interest is taking back his Universal title. At midnight tonight, whichever man wins will walk out the longest reigning WWE Universal Champion in history. Get ready for history to be made on night two of WrestleMania. All right, night two, WrestleMania, me and Roman Reigns. Universal title on the line. Oh, is it just the universal title? Because I don't know. If I'm Roman Reigns, I'd want to challenge for both those championships. That's just me, though. Roman Reigns coming in on his social once again, saying, I gifted Chris Damage the WWE Universal title, and now I'm going to get it back. I don't need a bloodline. I don't need a beast. I am going to take my title and whatever dignity... This imposter has left home with me tonight. Hashtag WrestleMania is my table. We'll see, Roman. We'll see. Let's get right to it. Regal, how's it going? You made it. I told you. I wouldn't miss this for the world. How are you feeling? You ready? You know... I've been getting the hell beat out of me for days. My ribs ache so bad it hurts to breathe. And uh, knowing Miz, I'm sure I'll have something up his sleeve. Typical Sunday night, then. Pretty much. I'd give you the full Churchill. But I don't think you need inspirational speeches anymore. No? You're a champion. Twice over. You've more than fulfilled your potential. 
So I'll save the pretty words for the next kid coming up. Thanks, Regal. For everything. All right. Thank you, Regal. Even though we had our differences in the past, I mean, war games. Oh, now Finn Balor's got something to say. You look like a man who walked out of a bar fight and into a prison riot. Well, thank you. I feel like hell. I think I'm the only person in this stadium who believes I'm going to win. Why the hell would you say that? Come on, man. You hear the locker room. They've been saying I'm a fluke since day one. <clears throat> oh, poor me. No one believes in the dark horse. Get a hold of yourself. I'm just being real. Seriously. In three plus years as champion, I would have thought you'd learn to silence the voices in your head. <laughs> I mean, I guess I just... You're so used to others doubting you that you won't let them believe in you. Logan Paul, Rhodes, they were all doubters and look at what you did to them. You were NXT champion. Roman never did that. Totally. I honestly forgot that I was the NXT champion at one time. So I've held the title for all three brands during the show. Maybe you have a point. You're damn right I do. You might not feel like it, but you're not the dark horse anymore. You're the favorite. So go out there and prove the biggest doubter of all wrong. I will, Finn. I will. But I feel like Sammy's going to have something to say next. Oh, no, it's going to go straight to match. Sammy doesn't have anything to say. The time has come. Chris Damage defends the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Roman Reigns. So it is just the uh, Universal title. Here we go. WrestleMania, whatever number this is, um, night two. And I think I got what they were doing as far as the theme of this WrestleMania. It's got a very um, presidential vibe to it. So I'm going to have to assume that uh, this WrestleMania is maybe in Washington, D.C. Uh, here I come with the championships. Stone Cold there to congratulate me. That Pip Squeak shaking his head no at me. Randy Orton cheering me on. Cody Rhodes, who we've had our differences in the past. Sami Zayn, one of my uh, buddies. And The Miz, who's had, who I've had the biggest heat with. Which I'm kind of surprised that this didn't end with me and The Miz at some point. Man, I can't wait. I really can't wait. I wonder, though, if this is uh, the end of the My Rise Undisputed. I guess we'll have to find out. And look at me in all my splendor and all my glory carrying my championships to the ring. And I will be leaving the ring 
with my championships. There we go. Celebrate with those belts, my man. Right now we've got, uh, well, here he comes. One Roman Reigns. Our tribal chief, who I am going to acknowledge, but not for this match, because I'm going to beat his ass. He thinks he can just wander in after giving up the championship. He thinks he can just leave for three years and then come back and demand a championship match. I mean, I gave him the championship match, but uh, three years, Roman... The WWE has changed a lot. And you're about to find out just how much that has changed. WWE Undisputed Universal Championship on the line. Introducing the challenge from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in 265. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in 200. 77 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion and the World Heavyweight Champion, the Spectrum Yeah, that's right. Hold those belts with pride, my man. All right, bell sounds. We are underway. Oh, and I just got a boot to the head. Time to get out of this. Come on. Okay, so take the fight to Roman. You know, I'm actually kind of surprised. Um, I don't see Paul Heyman at ringside. Kind of, uh, kind of thought we'd see Paul uh, accompanying Roman. Mm. 
Jesus, another boot to the head. Roman, uh, he's a bit of a... I was going to say he's uh, ahead of me, but I just shifted all my weight onto him. Get Roman with a heavy combo. Can't remember what a heavy combo is. Give me just one second. Okay. Got him with the heavy combo. There we go. Catch Roman. Get a hold of him with a grab. Yeah, there we go. Now we're onto some real footage here. As I spear Roman. Oh, he's got a hold of me in a choke. Or the guillotine, I mean. And oh, Mrs. Are, are we really going to see a Montreal screw job kind of thing here? Yep. Oh, yeah. Please get your hands on that little fucking pipsqueak. And Roman, well, Roman took him down. That's that's good, too. I'm just going <laughs> to, am I going to really finish Roman off just like this? Just like this. Mm, I hope. Yeah. Oh, geez. Uh, maybe, maybe not. Uh, we'll see. No, he kicks out. Wow. Roman, the fight continues for you. I'm just going to just going to beat the snot out of him for now. All right, Roman. Damn. Tried to mount a comeback. 
or I tried four, I come back, I should say. Didn't really mount one. And Roman just busted me open. Oh, geez, he just, I think he just caught me with the Superman punch, or at least he was trying for something that looked like a Superman punch. And over the top rope I go. Roman continuing his uh, his assault on me here. Gonna hit him with that power bomb and get the win. Wow. Just wow. I have officially tied Roman Reigns record with this championship. Oh, I've beaten Roman's record according to the announcers. And, of course, look how bloodied up Roman has got. I mean, this was a bloody feud between the two of us. This match wasn't just a match. It was a war. Roman, what's Roman doing? In all these years, I have successfully conquered every single one of my enemies. I'm just sitting here soaking it in right now as I'm looking at the fireworks going off in the background. And watching as Chris Damage raises his championships with pride and glory. Dude went through hell to keep that cha the uh, Universal Championship, the Undis... The world heavyweight title, he actually, um, well, he won that uh, in the last episode. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the My Rise of the My Rise Undisputed uh, story. Um, I've unlocked the WrestleMania My Rise, of course. Um, Ladies and gentlemen, though, what a fantastic run this has been. Uh, I want to thank everyone who's uh, tuned in to check it out. Uh, and starting soon enough, we are going to have the My Rise Unleashed story, which is the female My Rise. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, um, if you want to follow me, Follow me at the my final at my channels here, youtube.com at CBRS Entertainment, twitch.tv CBRS underscore entertainment, threads.net at CBS Films 83, Facebook.com, Chris.best83, TikTok.com, CBRS dot entertainment. Uh, if you want to follow our us and all of our different uh, programming we've got with Turnbuckle Studios, you can follow us right here at this video.
And uh, what now that we're done here, ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, your host, Chris Best, signing off. Be sure to tune on, uh, tune on over to uh, SmackDown Security Detail to check out what's going on on SmackDown right here on Turnbuckle Studios. Have a wonderful night, everybody.